Hey everyone, today we're going to go over the uplifting gospel song called Hallelujah, I'm Ready. This is on page 10 of gospel book number 3. This is originally titled I'm Ready to Go, and it was written by Don Pierce and first recorded by the Stanley Brothers uh, with the Clinch Mountain Boys back in 1960. So let's get started. Okay, this is a fast call and response song, originally recorded in the key of B-flat by the Stanley Brothers, uh, which most guitar players don't like very much, so they capo it up three and play it like it's in the key of G. However, if B-flat's not your key, try using a capo and find a close key that allows you to sing it how your vocal range allows it. I capo up two and play it in the key of A, but I also play it like it's in the key of G and like it's written in the book. Okay, the tempo for this one can be pretty quick. But it can be enjoyed between 120 to 160 beats per minute. Anything faster than that, and you should go to the Grand Ole Opry and hang out backstage. Okay, the strum pattern I feel on this is a down, down, up, down, up. A uh, one, two, and three, and type of strum pattern. With a hammer on hitting the D string, second fret like this. <laughs> You're really going to be singing it fast, uh, so just kind of get that that uh, strum pattern going. Okay, let's talk about the intro, the breaks, and the ending. This song uses the last two lines of the verse, so it's going to be a G, two, three, four, C, C, G, 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 D, D, G, G, three, four. And during the breaks between the chorus and verses, you can do that same intro. Or do a whole verse instrumentally and pick over it for like a performance if you want to do the whole verse. That works as well. Uh, and same with the ending too. If you want to do, um, if you just want to stop on the last chorus, repeat the chorus twice, put a, you know, a little instrumental break between those, kind of arrange it how you want to. That's pretty much an easy song to arrange and do it how you like. Okay, now if you're looking for to add some performance flair, this is a banquet of hammer-ons and pull-offs and get, can get pretty out of hand if you get carried away. But just create some nice inflections to keep it interesting and keep a steady rhythm to follow and then feel free to try adjusting your rhythm as it feels more comfortable to you. So... <laughs> you can really do this in any tempo you want. 
those fast pickers like to go really, really fast. Well, thank you for watching and hopefully subscribing if this is helpful to you. And I hope you enjoyed uh, Hallelujah, I'm Ready. And don't forget to get book number three with the chords and the lyrics for your iPad or phone. And we'll see you next Sunday. Hallelujah, I'm ready.